Hi everybody, this is part two in a series on organizing descriptive feedback with Google Forms. If you're creating a form for each of your subjects, you'll have one and another one and another one. And the issue is each of these individual forms will push to their own spreadsheet. So you'll still be looking at multiple spreadsheets to find all this information when it comes time to write your report card comments. What we want to do is push all of the data from each individual form into one master spreadsheet. The first thing you need to do is pick one of these forms and its spreadsheet. And since we were working with reading last time, we'll continue with that now. I'm going to go into this reading spreadsheet and I'm going to rename the entire spreadsheet instead of reading feedback, all feedback. And then I'm coming down here where it says form responses and renaming this tab reading. I'll leave it just like that. And if I go in here and refresh this folder, you'll see that there is now a spreadsheet that's called all feedback. Next, we're going to go into one of our forms, into the editable version. In the Responses drop-down menu, select Unlink the form. This will separate this form from its current Google spreadsheet. And it wants to just make sure that this is what you want to do. Say yes, unlink. And it is now unlinked. The next thing, go back into your drive and delete the spreadsheet that we just detached from its form. So here it is. I'm going to remove it and you don't have to worry if you had already filled out feedback in this Google form you will not lose any of your data it saves somewhere in the cloud and it will push directly to the new spreadsheet back in the editable form go ahead and click view responses again you could also go back into the drop down menu and click choose response destination either one will work now instead of choosing the default which is a new spreadsheet we want to click new sheet in an existing spreadsheet. Click choose. Now you have to choose the spreadsheet you want to push all of the data to. Right here you see the spreadsheet we just renamed all feedback. Click select. Now if you click view responses it will take you to that all feedback sheet and a new tab opens up. You can see the reading tab is still right here. This new tab is now your writing, so we're going to rename this tab writing. We'll do that again. We can go back and close these now. Let's go into oral communication. Edit the form, so we go into our editable form. Again, in the responses drop down menu, unlink the form. Yes, that's what I want to do. In my drive, I will delete this response spreadsheet. I no longer need it. In the oral communication, I go back and I click view responses again. Don't choose the default. New sheet in an existing spreadsheet. Choose all feedback. Select. And once again, it opens up the all feedback spreadsheet. You can now see I have my writing tab and my reading tab. I'll rename this one oral communication. And now if I go in here and I fill it out for student two, current event presentation, let's say we had a focus of appropriate body language and some feedback and maybe a next step for my own records and submit. And now if I head back into my all feedback spreadsheet and I click on the oral communication tab at the bottom, there's the feedback. I can wrap my text as I did before. I can format this a bit bold. I can spread out my columns slightly. And now all of my descriptive feedback from each Google form will automatically push into the same spreadsheet and it streamlines my work so everything is in the same place and it just makes it more efficient. I hope you found this helpful.